All right, what up, YouTube? Molly G, back at y'all in the episode of Running With Y'all on No Cap, No Filter. And said, not on Running With Y'all about breakups and is it corny to take back gifts after a breakup? <laughs> now, we all know Quavo and Sweetie then broke up. It was all on the internet or whatever. And it was reported that Quavo had took a Bentley back that he got from her, that he got for her after the breakup. But come to find out, it was just rumors and never happened. But I expect for it to happen. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Especially if he got that bitch in his name and he making payments on that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no way she he just going to let her ride in that bitch. You know what I'm saying? I'll take that bitch back. <laughs> Call me a petty nigga. <laughs> Fuck. You can put that in the comments down below. Petty nigga. Because that's what y'all going to say anyway about this goddamn video. Fuck it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because let's be honest. Niggas don't get no good gifts. Females get all the good gifts. They get their hair done, they get motherfucking nails, they get a fucking phone, you know what I'm saying? Nigga could know a female for only a week and a half and get them a phone and be paying a bill on that bitch. Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They get took on trips, they get goddamn jewelry, they get goddamn expensive as clothes, they get motherfucking a house. You give a female a house, you know what I'm saying? The damn wedding ring, you know what I'm saying? Females get a wedding ring, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what do a nigga get? Like, a nigga don't even... <laughs> nigga, can a nigga get a fucking necklace or something? Nigga, can a nigga get a fucking piece of uh, 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 something that could go on his wrist or something? Like, why the fuck a female can only get a ring and a nigga don't get nothing? I never understood that shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But they gonna feel like shit. Your gift, nigga, is me. Your gift is pussy yourself. Ain't that a bitch? That's just like when you ask a female, well, what you gonna bring to the table? They, they gonna respond something like, me? The fuck? I am the table. <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Niggas don't never get no good gifts. You know what I'm saying? But a female will get all that shit, dog. Jewelry, motherfucking all that shit. Cars. You know what I'm saying? A regular nigga will get a female a Nissan. You know what I'm saying? Fuck a Bentley. You know what I'm saying? What a nigga get? Some motherfucking uh, cologne. <laughs> Some motherfucking uh, polo drawers. Some... Uh, and, and then all that shit don't even count. You know what I'm saying? That's just like Valentine's Day when a nigga uh, get a female some lingerie or some, you know what I'm saying, bath and beyond or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's that, that that's benefiting him. He ripping the benefits of that too. It go, it, 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 go, it go both ways for both parties. Both parties getting a benefit. You know what I'm saying? So when a female get a nigga a gift, it's usually something that, you know, make him smell good or look good or be groomed looking well and all that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? So she ripping the benefits of that. The only thing I think a female could get a nigga as a gift and he don't want her to take that bitch back is like maybe like a TV or a, a, a game system. You know how niggas is about them game systems. But I be thinking females be getting them them game systems on purpose too. I think nigga re reap the benefits of that to keep a nigga inside. Don't make a nigga be out there in them streets. <laughs> so shit, it, it, it's a little bit of you know what I'm saying? Method to that madness with that shit. So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Wake up, fellas. But, you know what I'm saying? If, if, if you got into a breakup, I think a nigga would be mad if you try to come take his PlayStation. <laughs> you know how niggas get behind them PlayStations. But, uh, yeah, man, for niggas don't get no good gifts. And just like in a marriage, when you get divorced, shit, the female get all the good shit. You know what I'm saying? They want the house, the cars, the keys, and the, the fucking dog. They want it all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They want all that shit. Fuck. Um... Shit, and, that, and that's another thing. They're going to be like, oh, uh, well, I'm the gift. You know what I'm saying? Pussy is a gift itself. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Last I recall, don't you like dick too? Don't dick hold some type of value? You know what I'm saying? Like, damn. How the fuck you get hell? You get took on this trip. You get this motherfucking jewelry. You get motherfucking money and all this and all that. And you get dick. But when I get a gift, it's just pussy in itself. Be happy with that, nigga. <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, the fuck? Man, but I guess that's just a double standard, dog. And that's just a double standard that niggas could just deal with. You know what I'm saying? Like, un unlike women, you know what I'm saying? Niggas just, you know what I'm saying? See the double standard for what it is. You dig? But, yeah, man. Men don't get no good gifts. That's why a female would be quick to say it's lame or petty for a nigga to take back a good gift. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, yeah, man. Comment petty nigga in the comments. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you made it this far in the video. I'm saying I'm trying to, you know, be interactive or whatever. And if you had a bad breakup or whatever, go ahead on and tell me in the story. 
tell a story in the comments on, you know, what happened. Like when you had a bad breakup and somebody just tried to take something as, you know, that was given as a gift. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, most people, they feel like it's corny or lame to take a gift back. Because when you gave it to them, you gave it to them for them to have. It's theirs now. How you can, how you going to take back something that is for, from them now? For them now. You know what I'm saying? So... You taking it back at the breakup is like lame to some people, but I feel like it depends on the value of the gift. It depends on like the sentimental value, like like a dog. If you give a female a dog and she and you know damn well she don't he must take care of the dog good. You know what I'm saying? She only walk that bitch and take pictures with that bitch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But she don't go to no motherfucking hospital visit visits. She don't motherfucking wash that motherfucker like she supposed to. You know what I'm saying? She just there for all the good shit, not the hard work shit. Yeah, ain't take your dog back. Fuck that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If you making payments on a car, if you making payments on a phone, take that shit back. Fuck that. You don't want nothing in your name and somebody fucking with your name. Fuck that shit. Take that shit back. And sometimes when it come to jewelry, sometimes niggas be getting up, giving a female jewelry that was passed out in their family. That was sentimental value. Take that shit back. It depends on what type of sentimental value or financial value it holds to me. You know what I'm saying? But some people feel like by any means necessary, don't take no gifts back. And then sometimes you don't want nothing attached to you with that person after y'all done. You know what I'm saying? And I wonder how many gifts females got in their closet or just got period from past relationships i bet a female got at least one item from a nigga out their last five relationships <laughs> female got certain jackets certain motherfucking beanies certain fucking hats certain fucking little pants and shorts they just wear around the house just to you know lounging and shit like you know that was all a nigga shit all a gift from a nigga <laughs> you know what i'm saying but yeah, man, I feel like women, they get the good gifts and men don't get shit. You know what I'm saying? Then you can't take back the gifts that you gave a man. You know what I'm saying? Like, what you going to do with a uh, half a bottle of cologne? What you going to do with some drawers he didn't already want? What's some, what you going to do with some uh, polo shoes he didn't already want? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What you going to do with some boots a nigga didn't already want that you got? Them? You know what I'm saying? You can't take that shit back. You're going to take all the good shit back, but a nigga don't get good shit. <laughs> so, yeah, man, that's how I feel about the situation. And then another thing, niggas don't want another nigga to reap no benefits. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If a nigga got you a car as a gift, nigga damn sure don't want another nigga laid up in that bitch riding shotgun. <laughs> nigga damn sure don't want you out and about with another nigga and some jewelry that he didn't bought you. He's dead. Fuck. Oh, a phone that he didn't got you. You hitting up other niggas in a phone that he didn't got in. He still paying bills on that bitch. Fuck no. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, when a nigga thinking like that, nigga damn sure gonna be that petty nigga. Hashtag petty nigga. <laughs> but yeah, if y'all got a bad breakup story and somebody trying to take a gift back, you know what I'm saying? Let me know in the comments. And if you like the video, go ahead on and like it. And if you can, share the video. You dig? Uh, I'm trying to be more, you know, interactive with my subscribers or whatever and i just want to know what y'all feel about it by any means necessary is lame to take back gifts or you know what i'm saying it depends you know what i'm saying me i feel like it depends and if i'm gonna take that bit back i'm taking that bit back <laughs> you know what i'm saying call me petty and one thing i think we could learn about this shit that was going on it was a lot of back and forth shit on the internet and shit like i feel like you should always keep your business off the internet like i feel like you know what I'm saying? He shouldn't have said what he said. She shouldn't have said what he, she said. And they family member shouldn't have never got into it. And I feel like taking a gift back gonna only make shit more, you know, uh, difficult and shit. And then might could cause some uh, domestic violence and shit. So one thing we can learn from it is like, fuck, it. anything that transpired, keep your cool and stay off the internet. And you know what I'm saying? If a motherfucker got a gift that, you know, uh, you gave to them if it's gonna be a problem it ain't even worth it <laughs> it ain't even worth getting back so i want to know what y'all think man uh i'll be back at y'all with another video uh just stay tuned with me um yeah like comment and subscribe